A couple times a year, uh, I hold what I call my high intensity grinding course. It's three days long, covers conventional abrasives, super abrasives, dressing, cooling, burr, burn, chatter, everything on grinding. And what I've tried to do is I've taken basically grinding and I communicate that not from a standpoint of if this happens, do this, if this happens, do this, but from the bottom up. What actually happens with the wheel? How does the wheel wear? Chip formation and to give the attendees a deep understanding of grinding. Because if you understand something, not just, oh, if this happens, I do this, but really have an understanding of something, that's really when you can make very, very real, long-term, significant improvements. So I've had hundreds and hundreds of people go through the course. I hear back from them. And it's nice to hear back from them. They say, oh, God, my goodness, we're using every day the stuff that we learned in the course. We're all these things that we're using, reducing cycle times, cutting grinding costs, just general tr better grinding, troubleshooting problems. If they have an issue, it's not just kind of shooting in the dark anymore of let's try this and see if it works. It's, oh, we've got an issue. Let's understand what's going on with our grinding process. And then let's make intelligent choices about what to do. In the course, I give each attendee the book of grinding, 2,000 pages of material that I've built and created over the past 15 years that my guys who take my course refer back to all the time. So I hear back from them and they say, oh yeah, we use that book every day. Something comes up, we go to that, we say, oh, what's going on? We're constantly referring to the book of grinding. They also get the grinder's toolbox, which is a spreadsheet for calculating optimum grinding, dressing, and cooling parameters. And they say, oh yeah, we're constantly uh, putting values into the grinder's toolbox to see, oh, how are we doing? Are we too aggressive, not aggressive enough? Is our coolant velocity right? Everything else. If you really want to get a good handle of your grinding operations, you want to take ownership of your grinding, you want to get an understanding of grinding so that not just next week, but in the next five or 10 years, you can make significant improvements to your grinding operations. You want to attend the course. So the next grinding course is October 20th, 21st, and 22nd in Las Vegas at the Mirage Casino. It's a good one to go to. And then after that, we've got one in February, February 2nd, 3rd, and 4th outside Chicago, hosted by Greenlee Diamond Tool.